So one of the big issues that we face in the sales process is the creation of trust. The ability to create likability, I really like that person, I want to do business with them, I trust them because I like them, with the idea of competency or credibility, which is the documentation that, hey, I am the contractor of choice, I am the person that knows the most about this, I am the expert, but I'm doing it in a way that makes you feel confident, comfortable, relaxed, we're having a conversation, it's communication, it's very easygoing, amiable, relaxed, but I'm demonstrating the fact that I am, in fact, in command and control. I have this process. If I'm in Nome, Alaska, that's going to be a different design temperature than if I'm in, say, Columbus, Ohio. And if I'm in Phoenix, Arizona, I'm not even designing for heating at that point. I'm designing for cooling. So the design temperature of the area is driven by the manual J and by the EPA calculations based on the cooling load hours or the heating load hours or the combination of both. So Kansas City, Missouri is going to be different than Phoenix, Arizona, and that's going to be different than Miami and so forth. Drew and Russ's software is state of the art. It absolutely puts you in a position to recognize, you know what, um, they, they need insulation and that's an option. So we would say, you know, we can take care of that for you. And if you want to do that, that just adds a couple of dollars to the price. And so we're now driving up our discussion of average ticket. The customer has to make a decision. Do I want to spend more money on my energy bills or do I want to spend a little bit more money up front? And because we're going to finance this in most cases, the payment isn't going to change drastically. We can even extend the term of the payment out there farther and keep the payment down at a lower amount that's affordable and we can solve a problem and save them money in the energy process later. And that's the technique that we're going to be using.